by dispatching you to eternal misery at once. No, please, not Tibet. Oh, have mercy. Silence, pathetic dog. We must once more journey into the Delta time track on the heels of this poltroon. And I warn you, any disloyalty this time will be harshly dealt with. Indeed, it is a moor, a heathen. Well caught, lads. My lord, this is not the imp I saw. No, it's not me. What? Of course this is he. It was reliably reported to me that Fariner and a fiend such as this one started the great fire which now threatens the whole city of London. No, it wasn't me. The people seek vengeance. You and your sorcerer will be dispatched to hell where you belong. Sorcerer? Tell me where he is. I only wish I knew. Then I shall see to it that you are questioned. There's the imp! Seize him! There, you see? I told you it wasn't me. So you did, boy. Should you know of any sorcerer, understand that you are duty-bound to inform me on pain of death. <laughs> You robbed me of my only source of comfort, boy. Laszlo! Listen, boy, here and now, Fariner's the name. Thomas Fariner. So it was you. I was baker to his glorious majesty, King Charles II. Oh, he loved my Eccles cakes. Do you know I've been chased by a bloodthirsty mob? They said that I started the great fire, but I didn't. I didn't, I swear it. I'm just a simple baker. Oh, he loved my Eccles cakes. Twelve years, baker to his majesty. Never a spark out of place in the uh, in the kitchen. Then yesterday, whoosh, hmm? Pudding lanes cooked. London's ablazed. Echoes cakes all over the sea. And, Listen, and that's not all. My wife Kate, she's been arrested, and my son Matthew, he's lost somewhere in the flames. Look, we'll turn into patches of green slime if we don't find the Scarabaeus. Claim it and get out of this place. Of course, the Scarabaeus. That's why we're here. Well, it is here, and guess who knows exactly where it is? Bellor? No, you have fruitcake. I do, don't I? Came to me in a dream. Now, the clue to its whereabouts is hidden somewhere in a riddle. Shielded well so it comes not loose. Cheek of pig, feather of goose. Uh, well, what do you think? Great. Well, you better hurry up. Do you know the mayor's after you? I, I know. I'm on my way to give myself up now. Why? Because they've got Kate. They want me, not her. And what about me? And this? Oh, dear, dear. That's no better, is it? <laughs> <laughs> 
Still, never mind. <laughs> Neither's mine. Don't you worry, John. Phil, Phil. Leave it to me, eh? Look, it's no good, Laszlo. Let's get the Scarabaeus now, and then see about your wife. I must find Kate. They'll kill you if you give yourself up. Kill me. Impossible. The Scarabaeus, Laszlo. Kate. No. I must. <laughs> Mistress Farina, your dear husband appears to have survived the ordeal I created for him without becoming too singed. And as for your son... My son! What have you done to him? Where is he? Lost in the flames, most likely. Your son is not my concern. He is not spirited enough to try to rescue you. You speak lies, Countess. You are a witch. And once your husband is arrested, I can either set you free or send you to join him at the stake. Well, you should be yourself and you're not bewitched, Lord Mayor. Enough. You exhaust me, Kate Farriner. <laughs> I won't be here to exhaust you much longer. My Tom will find me, never fear. That fool will never rescue you from this. Mother, it's me, Matthew. Where are you? <coughs> Mother, what's happened to you? You do get arrested. Now, be honest, Laszlo. Can you really depend on your magic to get you out of trouble? No, that's not fair, Phil. Look, I I have to do something to find Kate. Why not use your magic to find her? No, 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 no not this time. It's not that easy. It's because you're frightened, isn't it? You might get it wrong, that's what it no, is. No, it's just that I can't think straight. Look, you must understand, Phil. I've got to do something to find where Kate is being held. You're right. Then let me go for the Scarabaeus. You said you know where it is. Well, sort of. Shielded well, so it comes not loose. Cheek of pink. I'm sorry, Phil, it's the only way. You did not see the creature again. He was most elusive, Sir Thomas. He simply vanished. Like soldiers' wits. Uh. What a fariner. He must be found and questioned. Go back into the tunnels, search every cranny, and don't come back here without him. Sir, I would like some protection. Protection? Well, this fire's no ordinary thing. It's the devil's own work. You're under St. Paul's, man. Is that not enough? Oh. Take this. It may protect you against the devil, but it won't protect you against me if you come back without the fire razors. Sir. Did you see that? I, I have not had success like that since I turned a, a bag of flour into a tray of cream horns. You see, I can still... Matthew? Is that you, lad? Father, I thought you were dead. Oh, Matthew, lad. 